Wow, look at this mess. So we have another GoPro external power video and I want to talk about what power banks you can use to power this thing. And there is this 2 amp theory that you need at least 2 amp supplied to the camera in order to do this. Um, my microphone here today, there, this is the one recording this audio. My Lorex I turned off for this video because it was way too loud in the other one. Now I have a laundry going on in the back. So that's maybe not perfect, but uh, we do have our trusted GoPro Hero 10 in here. And just to show you, we have a battery in there. We are going to check our firmware quick. In preferences about camera info, then you will see the firmware 1.40. 1.40 is the firmware I use with this camera. Let's turn it back off. And I um, try to record with the highest resolution there is, and the highest frame rate for that resolution. So it would be 5.6K and 60 frames per second. We remove the battery and then we see how this works. So already yesterday I showed that with an external power bank with USB that you are able to <coughs> run this. There's a more, few more tests we have to do. So I do have here a um, USB 3 cable that's blue inside here and the USB-C here. Um, I want to try that if that works today. Well, this is USB-A on here. But my power bank has also one in blue here. Plug that in there. And this output says it has 5, 9 or 12 volts, but it doesn't say how much amp it has. The one at the end here has 2.4 amp. So in theory, in theory it should work on both. So this one is on. <coughs> Let's turn that on and see what the camera says. It says no battery, there is no extra warning. I'm recording. And the camera is recording. That's good. Let's turn this thing off. I don't know if it matters when you lose power. Hope not. So then we use this other one here, this one here, the white one. It's supposed to be 2.4 amp on that one. So now it says it has not enough power connect to a 5 volt 2 amp. So I'm going to zoom in for you here that you can read this better. So it wants me to connect it to a 5 volt 2 amp power source or higher. And then it says also my GoPro will power off, right? So I don't know if it does it on its own or whatever, but um, we can see here on my uh, tab here, we can see that the one I'm using right now is supposed to have 2.4 amp. Well, we see it does not work. Now, who knows if this thing is correct, if, it, if it's true what it says. Because if we go here in USB 3 down here, the blue one, so this cable is blue. If we go in there, then it works. See that? Oh, it does not. Um, so you saw that it just worked. Now it does not work anymore. Isn't that something nice? Oh, let's try this again. See, now it works again. Maybe, maybe GoPro was a little bit confused. Okay, so it is working. Going off, and then we try this again. Here, <coughs> ready. So we are now on the white output. 
Okay. Where the manufacturer of the power bank says it, it works. See, now it works too. And that must be a bug in GoPro. So right now you can see it is working and it is plugged in here on the last one here. Right, and that one is blue, the middle one. And if I pull this out, you see it's white. But it says on the tab here 2.4 amp. Okay, so let's see what else we have. Um, if we take this to the side for a second, oh, we can uh, over here. I do have a car battery. And out of the car battery, I have a cigarette lighter output, and in that I can insert one of those. So that is a 12 volt car converter from 12 to uh, 1 amp and 2 amp. Two different connectors here. Yeah? I'm gonna plug this in here, and then you see the blue light. So it does have power from that battery. Let's use my same cable again here. This, and let's plug into the 2 amp first and see how this works. Look at that. It doesn't work at all. As if it has no power at all whatsoever. Isn't that nuts? No work whatsoever. So I have no idea. Does not work at all. Then let's try this one. I have no idea if the cigarette lighter thing works. Yeah. What does this tell you about this? I mean, I don't know if this works. I, I have no idea. This particular one. Maybe it's broken. No idea. So then I have this one here, the Wasabi Power. It's a hand grip. But this hand grip has only uh, one amp output. So this should not work at all. So if we plug this in here and try it, there should not be any... Uh, it should not work because it has only one amp. And in this case, this... Uh, message makes sense because the power supply says one amp so this cannot work okay let's power it off let's try it a second time uh, they get the same message so that's okay it cannot work now we have other possibilities here different cables, right? If we do USB-C to USB-C, does that always work? Can we use any cable? So this is a non-GoPro um, highly powered cable. You can tell it's very thick. So it can uh, transfer a high amperage. Let's try that. So it's USB-C to USB-C. And that clearly works, even with the recording here, no problem. So it's a no-name USB-C to USB-C. The one I have here is a blue cable, but I also have somewhere here, it's blue. I thought I had a regular here. So this is uh, also not too thin, but it has the white in here. This is a GoPro cable though, from an older GoPro. And we're gonna try if that works. Let's take this out. A GoPro, white in here. I'm going to go again on the white outlet here, on this side. And then in here, GoPro. 
see what that does. So it's here on the white outlet. Yeah, I have to turn this on. The power bank was not on. It turns on. It doesn't give the error message. And it records. See that? So this is a regular GoPro USB-A to USB-C white cable works on the white here. And you saw before that it didn't work once. It's maybe a glitch. Stop the record. Turn this off. off. And then we try the one with the blue down here. The blue connector, USB-3. Turn this back on. Works. Record. See, it does work. External power here. Stop recording there. And out. So, what I can try is this Amazon Bas Basic USB power supply. I do this sometimes when I do uh, outside work. I take an extension cord from my house, use a power supply like this, and then I can run it all night to, let's say, do um, like a night lapse or something. Let's try the same cable here. It's right in here, right? This one says 2.1 amp. I'm going to plug this into my outlet. I'm going to have to get the camera over here. There it is. Look that in here. See, it works. And I'm going to record. No problem. Right. So at this point, I have to assume as soon as you have this 2 amp requirement fulfilled. However you do that, however you do that with the 2 amp, if your power bank, it doesn't matter if it's a stick or if it's a flat power bank like this here or whatever shape or form it has, as long as it can supply 2 amp, then you should be able to run your GoPro from there without a battery. Um, you can use those USB-C to USB-C cables. They don't have to be GoPro cables. Um, we have GoPro cable here. Um, let's see, it says GoPro on it. The blue one here, USB 3 to GoPro. It's very thick. That was working. We have a no-name cable like that. That was working when we did the first test. And um, then we have this early GoPro cable where it's white in here and then USB-C. That was working too. Now, this one did not work. I don't know why. This is a, a cheap, very cheap converter for 12 volt to 5 volt. No idea why this doesn't work. Maybe there are some out there that work. I don't know. I don't have one right now. That would be a thing for the next video, I guess. And with that test done, I hope you have no problems with your GoPro on its own to run external power. Um, yesterday I showed that the in my other video up here, I showed that the media mod does not work with external power on the GoPro.